to my beloved Egyptian brothers and sisters, from the bottom of my heart, I wish you freedom. I see the people in Egypt fighting for their freedom. I see people suffering, specific people that are going out to the streets. And I hear the governments uh, putting fear in people's hearts. And I want to bring a new voice, a different voice. A voice that says that we are not so, so different from each other and then we can create something else together. I think here in Israel we feel you guys so much and so strong. And to be here today with all, the, all these guys outside, it really feels like we hold space for you. And um, I just hope that everything you wish for it to come in the best way will do. And, and it's a good example for, uh, for people in other countries that don't have the freedom to do what they really want. And I just send you love. You are fully an inspiration to me. Speak your heart out, even though your voice is shaking. I can hear you, and I love you. Salam. People of Egypt, I'm sending my love to you. I hear you. I'm with you, with my heart. I wish that uh, this time will pass with full love through the darkness. And uh, we will be together soon. So, my English is so bad, but I was really, really want to say something because it's very important to me. I think what you are doing are just the beginning of a new area, a new time. And I wish that uh, our people will start to do something like this. And you know that we are together like brothers and sisters. And we are in the same position. The, the same situation is in Israel. It's like in another kind of way. It's like not one um, prime minister, I think. Uh, in the control, it's like five of them for 50 years, so it's really the same and I really wish that you know that we're in the same boat. And I really, really dream of peace and love and happiness in the old Middle East. My, I have a good friend from Cairo that always said to me, Middle of what? What is the Middle East? His name is Sami, I love him. I've never been to Egypt. I've never been to Sinai. When I was 15, I wanted to go, and my mother said that it was too dangerous. Uh, I've since been to maybe half of the world, and my mother still won't let me go to Egypt or to Sinai. And I don't really know what's going on there, and, but I hear and I can feel that there is suffering. And I just want you to know that for a while now, I've been praying every day. I've been praying every day for there to be no more fear. I've been praying for love and peace. And to that I want to join now a prayer that, that whatever is happening is for the best. Uh, and for a smooth transition. People of Egypt, I was watching you in the last few weeks and the whole world is watching you now and with fear, with, it, with admiring you and loving you and um, waiting to see what will happen from this big new thing that happened in Egypt. My feeling for you is that you, you have you have uh, broken uh, the border of fear. You just broke a big wall of fear that was surrounding you 
and this is amazing um, uh, inspiration for all of, all the world to see this and inshallah from this uh, and it's already happening from this all nation will understand all people all over the world will understand that we can be together we can bring our voice and we can have our own freedom and uh, independence and rights so i want to express my support to all my friends uh, in egypt and uh, all the other people there that i don't know but i feel them as my brothers and sisters um, and I truly believe they deserve to live uh, in freedom um, without suppression and repression and um, I really hope they can stop fighting for the rights and just uh, live simply as human beings. Resulti Resulti la nafsi awalan لأولادي لعائلتي لجيراني وصحابي لكل إنسان عم يدافع عن حريته ربنا خلقنا روح حرة كل من عم يحارب لحرية نفسه مهم جدا أنه يكون واثق من إيمانه من طريقه من دربه ويحارب لحريته I just wanted to say thank you for trying to make the world a better place and just know that there's a lot of amazing people here in Israel who are trying to make a change as well in a peaceful way um, through music and through art and um, we just want to show our support in any way possible and send you our love because we're feeling you really deeply and yeah, we're with you and you're inspiring us for change and uh, be strong Salam Alaikum <laughs> Yes, Salam We love you very much Hope you're okay Sending you love and good vibes from Yafo. To all my friends, with open heart, I just want to tell you how much I love you. I was really afraid I was going to cry in front of the camera, and that's what's happening. So, this is my heart opening. People of Egypt, Maybe this time you have a chance for real freedom. It's a moment of changes. Can be taken for good. Can be taken for making something better. You just wish for us this ability to really see, to really see each other beyond all this governmenting all these um, all these ideas all these concepts to be able to fill our heart to say the truth in our heart and to meet each other in the deepest level in the deepest place and to know that we are there together with the same request with the same need for freedom, for love, for happiness. I want to say thank you to all the people of Egypt for your heart, for your brave uh, spirits, for your strong heart and bodies, for uh, initiating this, uh, this uh, powerful uh, thing that is happening now in your country. I want to say thank you for all the people that are putting their hearts, their bodies, their, their anger, their fear, all the, all the hard things you are passing, I want to thank each one of you for, for doing this um, from all my heart. I want to, to empower you with what you are doing and uh, telling, I say to you that uh, it's a big example uh, for us here in Israel. 
It's a big example for the whole world to see how people, how each heart have the power to, to create, to, to change, to do good on the planet. It's a big, big, big example for us. And I pray for your strength and I pray for your empowerment and I pray that each step in, your la in what you are doing now is, is going to continue. And I pray for the safety of each one of you and your children and your women and all the men that are holding the, the space of their heart, that are sharing their heart and, and power and knowledge and responsibility for their life. Thank you very much. يا أولاد نصاف نريد يلا نطلع المريض راح نطير ونشوف بلاد نتعرف أصحاب جداد يلا نرفرف يلا نطير ونسافر مثل العصفير راح نطير ونشوف بلاد نتعرف أصحاب جداد To all my Egyptian friends and family We love you all We wish you freedom soon Shalom, my uh, brothers and sisters in Egypt. Uh, hello. I'm sending you a lot of love and uh, a lot of um, power. I see you. I see your pain. I love you very much. And I want to tell you that uh, our hearts is connected together and we are praying for you. And we are praying for your peace. And we are praying for your... Uh, health and we are praying for your happiness and I love you very much and I pray for you. Atik al Afia, Salam Alaikum. May peace be in your in your country and in our country and may we, we live in peace together. I love you so much. <laughs>